back with me with another episode of Office 365. By now, I'm sure you have known some basics of it. So let's dive into where the app launcher is in Office 365. Microsoft Office 365 is your one-stop shop for quality business software and application. Using it is very easy, especially with the app launcher at the top of Web Outlook and online Office applications. Here are the details on the Office 365 app launcher, where to find it, and how to customize it for your team. The Microsoft navigation bar is at the top of Web Outlook and Apps. Look for the icon with nine dots on the far left. This is the app launcher that allows you to access different parts of Office 365, such as Outlook Mail, OneDrive, People, Calendar, and more. The app launcher is where you go to open all the different apps available in Office 365. You can see your apps on the top and recent online documents underneath. Just select an app to switch between them. You can add more apps to the launcher, but you cannot remove any that are already there. The app launcher may also be branded to fit your business colors and style. To add apps, open the app launcher and click the All Apps button. Highlight the desired app and click the three-dot icon that pops up to the right of the name. Once the menu appears, press Pin to Launcher to finish adding the app. Another thing to highlight, the tiles displayed in your app launcher depend on what's included in your subscription license. Some apps won't appear in the app launcher until the Office 365 administrators activate them. Microsoft recommends using the app launcher with Microsoft Edge and Windows 10, but if that's not available, try the most up-to-date versions of Google Chrome and Mozilla Firefox. You can customize the app launcher by adding custom tiles to SharePoint sites, external pages, and legacy apps. You can pin these apps to your home apps so they appear near the top. So that's about everything you should know about App Launcher in Office 365. I'll see you in the next episode.